Uh, I was going to bring my A game against Elliot anyway after that last fight. I was going to bring my A game no matter what, you know. I was going to try my best to get this W. I need it too, man. I lost freaking two in a row. Dude, this sucks. I need a win already. What the hell? Mm -hmm. Lewis, when you look at Tim's style of fighting, it's very unpredictable. He has this crazy style where he's just all over the place and you don't really know exactly what he's going to do. Does that make it difficult to prepare for a guy like that? Or do you kind of invite a little bit of a chaos like that? Um, I guess a little bit of both. Like, it is kind of scary, you know, because it is really unpredictable. But at the same time, it kind of makes it fun, you know? Like, makes your butthole tight. You're like, oh, fuck, <laughs> you know? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's scary, dude. It fuckers up your butthole, you know? Like, fuck. It gives you a nice little adrenaline rush. I feel like that's what we live for, you know? Right. Like, one of my favorite things is when you're in the pocket and you're exchanging and, like, a guy, like, throws a punch and it whizzes right by your face and uh -huh. you're like, and it, like, it really scares you because you're like, oh, man, like, two inches to the right and that would have knocked me out. Like, that's one of my favorite things. Like, oh, I barely got out of the way of that. Like, there are still those critical moments where you do freak out, you know, like the pivotal moments. Definitely. Well, Lewis, we'll keep it short for today. I know your camp is winding up soon, but we want to thank you as always for making time for us.